Hey everybody, Ann here, and I'm just out going for a little walk with with my girl. And you know what? I've been looking at some of the other campsites that people have been staying at, and I've been seeing some really cool stuff. Some artwork that they've left behind. Alrighty. First stop is weird looking. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but it is just really cool looking and I touched it a little bit earlier it is not none of this is nailed together it almost looks like a twisted body or an A A for Anne but um, yeah none of it is nailed on it's just um, laid strategically so that everything would hold together and stay up and then I also saw this somebody made a pretty wreath I wonder if I can do that. You know what? I think that I might have to do a project tomorrow. But yeah, they just hung it up and it was really pretty. And um, I think there's at least one other spot too. Hang on. And then again, there are some campers who need to be scolded. That's a empty water bottle floating out in, in the middle of the lake. And you know what? Fire pits are not where you dump your trash and leave it. This is nasty. Here's the other one. Check it out. I don't know what it was supposed to be, but they just kind of put it on the tree and it looks beautiful. And then, I don't know if it's the same person, somebody tied a nice little bow, and I love finding stuff like this. It just, I don't know, it just makes me feel happy. So, you know what, before I leave here, I'm going to try and do something like this too. The rule that says, leave no trace. They left traces. Check that out. You can see what that is, can't you? You know what's, what's happened here. You're supposed to, to bury it at least six inches. And um, not within a hundred feet of water. So, gross. And check that out. Can you see that bag? Can you see that? Let's see if I can get a better shot of it. Look at what's in the bottom of that. I don't even want to know. How could somebody just leave that out here? Gross. So I don't know. There's a lot of beauty in the Daniel Boone National Forest, but there's also people who are just gross. You know, and I had thought, well, I'm going to be, when I leave this place for good, of course, I take all my trash with me. I'm, I've done it twice already, the two times I've gone into town. But um, I'm going to pick up the stuff around my camp, even if I didn't leave it. But though that other stuff, there's the, the hanging bag, I would have to, there's no trash service out here. Um, I would have to, to take it and put it maybe in another bag and put it in my van and drive all the way to town that with that stinking bag of, you know there's crap in it. I don't think I can do that. I'd consider burning it. You know what, that's an idea. I could take it over to that nasty fire pit and um, just burn it, you know? I don't know what the solution is to tell you the truth, but I'm gonna be here probably, I don't know, till I run out of food, till I run out of ice. Um, I still had ice on me when I uh, went into town today, but I just got some more, so I think I'm just going to do some exploring and a few projects, maybe try and make some art pieces for the Daniel Boone National Forest, um, you know, Artwork Society. <laughs> I, don't, I don't really think there's one of those, but um, I, guys, I cannot tell you how, whew, how relieved I am going into town makes my heart beat fast. Coming out here, it takes me 20 minutes just to kind of like, <sighs> but I tell you what, I, and I mentioned this to somebody in the, my comment section, I could literally sit out here and just stare at this lake, just, just where I'm sitting right now, and just stare at this lake for hours. But I've been doing some reading too, um, and you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about that book I'm reading because I want you guys to read it too. It's a classic. You can buy it. Well, you can get it for free um, on Amazon, and um, 
it's a it's a good book. It's so relatable to me. So um, I'll share that pretty soon with you. But I think as for tomorrow, I am gonna try and find some projects to do that are fun. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.